I have a really awesome video for you all today. I think I have found the next big penny stock in the market. This is a stock that just had a major share reduction, increasing shareholder value significantly. They just achieved pink current and have major catalysts coming their way. Slap that like button right now if you enjoy these penny stock videos. And I just today uploaded day six of the $10,000 penny stock challenge on the patreon the link to that is down in the description below we started with a fresh ten thousand dollar portfolio and i post an exclusive video update daily of my portfolio all of my buys and sells and that includes all of these stock picks early and access to the private discord so go down there check that out if you do want to be in on that but a quick update on FERN. This is not the stock we are talking about in today's video, but is a stock that I've been talking about a lot recently, made a lot of videos on, and we made the first FERN video when it was at 0 0.004. It hit new highs today of 0 0.0085 in the morning and is now sitting at 0 0.0074 around that price. I don't know what price it is when you're watching this video now, but that is what it is at the time of the recording. So, the first video, we made it right down here at 0.004. After the video, it hit a high of 0.006. And just recently today, it hit a high of 0.0085. So some very, very major gains. Um, they have a lot more coming, but let's talk about this a little bit more. So if you bought 10,000 shares of Fern at a purchase price of 0.004, and you went ahead and sold it at the high of 0.0085, for example, you bought it at $40 and you sold it for $85. That, that is a profit of $45 and a 112% return on investment in less than a month. So we are already locked in over 100% gains on Fern. I'm going to be adding on the dips on this if it does dip anymore because they have not yet even hit pink current or released an official PR of what their plans are. When that hits, I expect more movement to the upside. I will have more video updates on this one coming up very soon as they do continue to release more news. But in today's video, we are talking about WOGI. I first heard about this from Tactical Trading. I will link his Twitter down in the description below. So go ahead and check him out. But World Oil Group is a holding company actively pursuing acquisitions in the fintech and gold industries. World Oil Group provides a turnkey oil and gas drilling opportunity via direct participation in oil city, Pennsylvania, and surrounding areas. World Oil Group works with joint venture partners using its proprietary technology to clean and increase oil production in oil fields that are not producing up to the well capabilities. WOGI's products are non-toxic, non-flammable, and non-carcinogenic that are designed for the oil and gas industry. These companies Products can clean toxic oil spills, clean total oil formations, clean oil and tank pipelines, and even life heavy oils that were once not cost effective for ONG companies. World Oil Group's proprietary clean technology is reducing the cost of oil extraction around the globe. So they are around the globe, they are worldwide. World Oil Group's Latin America operations are located in Lima, Peru, by and through a subsidiary WOGI South America. WOGI South America is registered for oil and gas exploration, exploitation, commodities trading, mining, agriculture, real estate, and business consulting, and also import and export. So that is a little list right there of what they are currently in. So World Oil Group South America is engaged in commodities trading in gold, copper, and agriculture. So if you want to know what they are into, read these two bottom sentences right there. Currently, WOGI is sitting at six cents, a $50 million market cap, and they are currently pink current. I think this is an undervalued company. Their authorized shares are 1 billion. We're going to talk more about that share reduction in this video. And WOGI has major catalysts coming its way, including two acquisitions. Just recently, WAGI achieved pink current and had a major share reduction. The total authorized shares decreased from 5 billion all the way down to only 1 billion and they have further reductions to the share structure coming their way. What is a share reduction? You guys might not know what this is. A capital reduction is the process of decreasing a company's shareholder equity through share cancellations and share repurchases, also known as share buybacks. The reduction of the capital is done by companies for numerous reasons, including increasing shareholder value and producing a more efficient capital share structure. OK, so further reductions to their share structure are actually coming. They already reduced it from five billion to one billion. Take a look here. This is what it was before the reduction five billion shares and now 
their authorized shares are 1 billion. That's a major, major decrease. This could be setting this up for a nice run after we get some more PRs coming, after we get those um, acquisitions coming in. So they tweeted on April 22nd, we wish to thank our shareholders for their patience. We made a simple correction with OTC markets, which is now in the final review that was posted before they achieved pink current. They are now pink current, so they are following through on their promises. We are also in the process of making a further reduction, you know, on top of the one they already made from five billion to one billion, a further reduction to the share structure. Stay tuned for further updates. That would be major. You know, if they can get below a billion, you know, maybe 500 million. I don't know if that's going to happen, but that would be actually impressive if they were able to do that. And this is a couple of their product projects, a project one oil city, Pennsylvania. This is a 10 well oil drilling project. I will link this website in the description below for you to check this out and project two, it's in Peru mixed use projects. So I will link this down below if you want to read up more on their projects and the most recent PR and upcoming catalyst. So this is the most recent PR on April 13th, and it tells you a lot of what they plan to do in the future. There is already a couple things in this PR that they did, you know, already follow through on. So everything else in this PR that they have not yet to follow through on, I have no reason to, you know, not believe that they won't get these acquisitions in and follow through on their other promises because they have already followed through on many of the promises they have stated in this April 13th PR. So on April 13th, they announced it has canceled 2.12 billion or 71% of its common shares ahead of its first acquisition. So they reduced the shares. They got pink current. Guess what's next? the acquisitions the acquisitions are coming next you guys this is what is making me really excited for this company so leaving the issued and outstanding at 133 million common shares the company has also reduced its authorized shares down to 1 billion from 5 billion and like i said just a second ago they plan to further reduce that number which is very very impressive the ceo stated this reduction was done to accommodate the new company's management which also plans additional cancellations of common stock our transfer agent will reflect these changes in the coming days claudio also stated that world oil group has no toxic debt, no debt, and they will not be doing a reverse split. So no debt, no reverse split, very, very major. Instead of the reverse split, they're gonna be doing share buybacks, they're gonna be do, doing share reductions, which actually increases shareholder value significantly in the short term and in the long term. They have not released an official PR yet since achieving pink current so they not they really haven't like gone out and said what their their plans are with these acquisitions yet. and that that's the catalyst that we are waiting for here if they were were to come out with a new acquisition in a pr very soon this should move the stock price higher they have announced a major share reduction setting this up nicely for a run after they announced the first acquisition so they have already done a share reduction and they also announced another one coming soon they also did mention two acquisitions so there should be one and then there should be another one soon after the first wogi has no debt and will not be doing a reverse split instead of a split they plan to do share reduction and buybacks so i'm very very excited for w OGI. I'm very, very excited for Fern. I'm very, very excited for a lot of these stocks I've talked about in my videos recently. We have made some significant gains. So subscribe right now if you do want to get in on more of these gains. And if you do want to hop in on the $10,000 penny stock challenge, the link to that is down below. Just go ahead and click that link. It is a very awesome community. Check that out. And if you want two free stocks valued up to 1850, the stock market exchange link is down below. Practically free money. You get two free stocks maybe 1850. Check that out real quick. That is it for the video. I'm very, very excited for WOGI. It has gone up a good bit since I made the Patreon post. And you know, that's it for the video you guys today. Make sure you leave a comment down below with what stocks you are invested in. And um, that is it for me. Peace.